hello, 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 my beautiful Aqua gang. What's up? What it do? Y'all already know what time it is. It's your girl, Life of Peaky, and I am back again with another reading. This one will be for my Aqua couples. No contact for my Aqua couples. So we're going to go ahead and tap in. We're going to see what's going on with my Aqua couples that have not had any contact with their significant other, their person, the person that they are in a relationship, situationship with honey let's go ahead and get on into it spirit what messages do we have for my aquarius couples that are in relationship situationship but are not currently speaking to their person spirit what messages do we have for my aqua couples okay it was another one that flipped let's see here it is think that's it y'all y'all see right we gonna jump on in and get on in jump on in so at the bottom of the deck you got wedding rings union wedding married soul connection eternal love everlasting promise so this could definitely be someone that you're married to in a committed relationship with um that you're not currently speaking to right now or you know this is what they want to talk about but they're scared they're nervous to talk about it with you honey i don't know take it how i resonate this could definitely be someone wanting to get married someone that promised that you guys were going to get married they were going to make this commitment um make it last forever I don't know, y'all. Take it how it resonates. You got the sword and the rose. Clarity, truth, revelation, solidarity, uh, force, honor, protection, and power. Yeah, so some of y'all could definitely be gaining some clarity right now. Clarity within this situation. You're finding out the truth. You've had a few revelations regarding this situation. Something, something recently could have woken you up. Um, regarding this situation, it could be this no contact or this fact. The fact that you guys are not talking right now, this could... Uh, be bringing you the clarity that you need. Um, this could be a forced um, moment where you guys are not able to communicate with each other right now. Um, yeah, honor, protection, power. Some of you are definitely protected. You're being protected from this situation, which is why you're not talking. Sometimes rejection is God's protection, so take that how that resonates. Addiction, codependent, obsession, possession, controlling has a block restraint. So somebody here is definitely addicted to something or someone, um, and it's causing a block or it's causing someone to restrain themselves from the situation. They're having issues controlling this obsession or this addiction I just heard as well, honey. This could be someone obsessed with you. Or obsessed with your person. Take it how it resonates. You also got girl talk, time with friends, moving on, happily single, living in the moment, having fun. So this could be y'all going out with y'all friends, telling y'all friends that y'all feel like y'all single right now, honey. I'm single. I ain't talked to him or her in four, five days, baby. No call, no show, new hoe. Ooh. Y'all just living in the moment, having fun. You're not thinking about what happened between you and your person. In the past, you're not thinking about any of that. Not enough. Frustrated in a relationship. Lack of confidence. Self-sabotage. Fear. Ego issues. Jealousy. Yeah, so this is going under the sword and rose. So I definitely feel like someone gained clarity or you got the truth about it. Maybe this person was frustrated in the relationship or maybe you were frustrated in this relationship. This person could have possibly sabotaged this relationship on their own. They do a lot of self-sabotaging. Take it how it resonate. I just burped. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, someone here is jealous. Like I said, this could be another person um, involved in this situation that's obsessed with your person, but they're jealous of you. The dragonfly, be lighthearted, finding out things, coming to light, adapt, change, heal. So this is going under addiction. So you could have just found out about this person's addiction or about this person that's addicted or obsessed with your person. You could have just found out about this. Something came to light within this situation and it caused a separation. It caused you two to have to separate. Sadness, missing you, thinking about you, yearning, unsure future or unsure of the future. Yeah, so this situation that you two are going through, it definitely caused a separation 
between you two. Um, this third party could have had a lot to do with that separation I just heard. Not sure how that resonates with any of my aquas here, honey. There could be someone that's super obsessed with you or your person. They're jealous. Somebody here is jealous, Aqua. Spirit, what other messages do we have for my Aquarius collectives, my couples, my Aqua couples that are in relationships with no contact? Spirit, what other messages do we have for my Aqua couples that are in relationship, no contact? Got change. Yeah, it's time for some change to take place. Something that's going to bring you fulfillment. Go Go with your good. You got courthouse at the bottom of the deck. So especially with I, with it being a commitment here, this could be your baby daddy, baby mama, husband, wife, fiance. Take it how it resonates, honey. But there's definitely going to be a change that takes place that's going to um, cause some separation. You got main mail. Oh, you got a lot just came out. So let me see. Something flipped in the deck. Yeah, this could definitely be something to cause this separation between you and, and your person. Um, false person jumped out. So, yeah, there could be third party energy here. Someone here is pretending to be your friend or pretending that they are friends with you to get closer to your person. Take that how it resonates. Um, I'm going to put that on top of girl talking separation, honey, because, yeah, I feel like this is causing this separation. This false person, they're they're pretending like they're um, your friend or your person's friend to get closer to you. Take it how it resonates. You also got main female, mature woman, judication, and main male. So, yeah, with this main female coming out, I definitely feel like you're the main female in this situation. The mature woman could definitely be your mom or your person's mom, grandma, take it how it resonates. Someone older here could be causing this situation to, I'm going to put this over here, it could be causing this situation um, to have all these issues or they're coming in the middle of your situation with your person. This could be their mom or your mom, take it how it resonates. They could be Pretending that they like you or pretending like, you know, shit all good when really they know what's going on. They don't really want you to be with their son or their daughter, honey. Take a high resonate. You got main male and main female showing up. So, yeah, this is definitely main character energy, honey. Take a high resonate. My aquas, you could definitely be dealing with a situation where the family is involved and now you're going to have to go to court to... um Set some boundaries, set some changes here. Something has to change. Something has to give. And you also got gift at the bottom of the deck. So somebody could be giving you a gift. I don't know. Take it how it resonates with one and seven is eight. So that's action. So somebody here is definitely going to stand up and take action or take the action towards um, making this situation better. I just heard. Take it how it resonates. This could be a gift from your spirit guides letting you know. Like, hey, you got to go on and let this shit go. They mama toxic. They daddy toxic. They whole family toxic. Spirit, what other messages do we have for my aqua collectives, my couples that are not in relationship? I mean, that are in relationship, that are not currently talking to their person, no contact with their person. What other messages do we have for my Aquarius collective? Couples, no contact. Look, is on your side. New moon in Sagittarius. So, yeah, some of y'all are definitely getting a lucky break or catching a lucky break right now, especially with that gift showing up. You're going to get a unexpected gift out of nowhere we're gonna stop that there um you're gonna get an unexpected gift out of nowhere luck is on your side so it's time to go ahead and release that negativity full moon in scorpio it's time to release that negativity you got new moon in sag full moon in scorpio and then work through your fears new moon in scorpio yeah so it's time to release that energy release that negativity work through your fears and it's time to go ahead and start your healing process. Start healing from this situation because you know deep down in your heart that it is over or it's about to be because y'all ain't even talking. <coughs> y'all ain't even talking. It's about to be over. Spirit, what's T? What's T, sis? Somebody here got a secret lover. Whether it's you or your person, there's a secret lover here. There's a third party. Somebody's secretly in love with somebody, and you're going to find out about it. 
or they're going to find out about this secret lover and it's going to change everything regardless. Karmic, this shit is toxic as fuck. So yeah, this shit toxic. Somebody here is going to find out that they've been whole time. Somebody here has been living a double life. Somebody here got somebody on the side that they playing patty cake with, honey. One more card, Spirit. What other messages do we have? I'm on a new level. Yeah, y'all leveling up, Aqua. The Aqua's leveling up. And you also got sneaky links. I don't know. Take that how I resonate, honey. Somebody here is sneaking up. Sneaking up. Sneaking out and linking up with a sneaky link, they secret lover, honey. And you're going to eventually find out about it. Or you already know about it. You're going to be the mature person here. You're going to be the mature woman to walk away from this situation. Main male and main female fell on top of addiction. And the dragonfly, y'all, take it how it resonates. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to go ahead and leave it here, Aqua Gang. I love you, love you, love you guys. And I will see you in the next one. Peace out.